today I'm going to share an Irish pub meal in Dublin. The pub is located just near Trinity College and Grafton Street, right in the centre of Dublin. If you head to Suffolk Street and take a little walk along, there's actually quite a few pubs and restaurants and the Voca store as well, which I always like having a little browse around. It's quite a bustling spot within Dublin and it's very handy if you're sightseeing and looking for somewhere to have breakfast, lunch or dinner in the centre of Dublin. So the pub I'm taking you today is called O'Neill's. It is, as I said, on Suffolk Street, right in the centre of Dublin. And it's quite an architecturally beautiful exterior to the pub. And as you'll see when you step inside, it's a traditional Irish pub, pretty lively. As you could hear downstairs it was pretty loud and noisy and I wanted some peace and quiet for my lunchtime after walking around Dublin. So I headed upstairs where it was super quiet and nice and peaceful. So here is a look at the O'Neill's pub menu. There's a couple of soups on offer, which is always a good bargain. There are special items, nacho platter, vegetarian pie, shepherd's pie, cottage pie, Irish stew, stew and beef and Guinness pie to choose from that are Irish specialities. There are also some tempting desserts to choose from. Bailey's cheesecake, apple crumble, real nice choice and there's sandwich selections. I was there lunchtime but I did opt for one of the specials as you'll see. But there are a lot of different sandwiches that you can choose from. I saw some sandwiches going to other people who were within the pub and they looked really nice really hearty lots of choice all day panini there as well but I just kind of sat back and enjoyed the peace and quiet upstairs here until my meal arrived so I went for the traditional Irish stew which has tender Wicklow lamb potatoes carrots onion and it also came with a couple of pieces of soda bread and some Irish butter of course too found the meat to be lovely and tender, vegetables well seasoned and the broth really full of flavour. I always like smothering my bread with butter and dipping it into the broth and makes for a lovely hearty way to enjoy an Irish stew. So that is my video for today with my Irish pub meal in Dublin. Thank you so much for watching. Be sure to leave a like, subscribe for more videos, comment too. Let me know if you want me to show you other spots around Dublin in the future as well. So thank you so much for watching and we'll see you again soon. Bye.